Maybe it Cri doesn't Christine, mean anything. Christine Berzina, your thoughts. Yeah, my thoughts on this. It is right that every American administration since the 70s has disliked Russian-German, Soviet-German energy relations. That has been a consistent bipartisan position. Absolutely, that's a fact. It is a completely different question about whether the U.S. policy against a German-Russian energy relationship um, is undesirable versus blowing up something that is um, both uh, a piece of property that oh, is, is shared between one of your closest allies and a feared adversary. Uh, and I think the leap to say, just because you don't like something, you are going to blow it up, that is a ridiculous one, mostly. Uh, it is as though saying you don't like a classmate and therefore you will attack them. Now, this is not, I don't think this is a reasonable position. And I think that the Cy Hirsch article also receives a fair amount of eye rolling in Washington, again, based on one anonymous source, which feels uh, a very weak basis to have, um, to have the conversation on. Well, let's and get back. instead, let's... I Go think ahead. you can look at, you know, what is the Biden administration seeking to do throughout all this time? It is seeking to tremendously repair the ties um, that the Trump administration had broken to Europe. This isn't then consistent uh, with such an operation. And if you look at the Biden administration's behavior with relation to Ukraine, the fear of Russian escalation has been a dampening and force of restraint specifically on this administration, much to the chagrin of, uh, of many. And so uh, to do something that is both so unfriendly to an ally and so potentially escalatory to a nuclear adversary, I find uh, not a very reasonable d uh, idea. Uh, Reuters, Ange Andrea, you guys the first question. Thank you, Mr. President, and uh, thank you, Chancellor Schultz. Um, Mr. President, I have wanted to ask you about this um, Nord Stream project that you've long opposed. You didn't mention it just now by name, nor did Chancellor Schultz. Did you receive assurances from Chancellor Schultz today that Germany will, in fact, pull the plug on this project uh, if Russia invades Ukraine? And did you discuss what the definition of invasion could be? Let me answer the first question first. If Germany, if, uh, if Russia invades, uh, that means tanks or troops crossing the, uh, the, the border of Ukraine uh, again, then uh, there, will be, uh, we, there will be no longer a Nord Stream 2. We, we will bring an end to it. What do, what, how, will you, how will you do that exactly since the project and control of the project is within Germany's control. We will, uh, I promise you, we'll be able to do it. 